ಓಂ ಸದಾಶಿವ ಸಮಾರಂಭಾಂ ಶಂಕರಾಚಾರ್ಯ ಮಧ್ಯಮಾಂ ಅಸ್ಮದಾಚಾರ್ಯ ಪರ್ಯಂತ ಒಂದೇ ಗುರುಪರಂಪರಾಂ ಶ್ರುತಿ ಸ್ಮೃತಿ ಪುರಾಣ ಆಲಯ ಕರುಣಾಲಯ ನಮಾಯು ಭಗವತ್ಪಾದ ಶಂಕರ ಲೋಕಶಂಕರಂ ಶಂಕರಂ ಶಂಕರಾಚಾರ್ಯ ಕೇಶವಂಬಾದರಾಯಣ ಸೂತ್ರಭಾಷ್ಯಕೃತೌ ವಂದೇ ಭಗವಂತ ಪುನಃ ಪುನಃ ಈಶ್ವರೋ ಗುರುರಾತ್ಮೇತಿ ಮೂರ್ತಿಭೇದ ವಿಭಾಗಿನೆ ವ್ಯೋಮವದ್ಯಾಪ್ತೇಹಾಯ ದಕ್ಷಿಣಾಮೂರ್ತ ನಮಃ ಸಹನಾವತು ಸಹನೌನಕ್ತು ಸಹ ವೀರ್ಯಂಕರವಾಹೈ ತೇಜಸ್ವಿನಾವತೀತಮಸ್ತುಮಾವಿತ್ಯುಷಾವೈ ಏಂ ಶಾಂತಿ 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 ಓಂ ನಾರಾಯಣ ಪರೋ ವ್ಯಕ್ತ ದಂಡಮೋ ವ್ಯಕ್ತ ಸಂಭವಂ ಮಂಡಸ್ಯಾಂತಸ್ತು ಮೇ ಲೋಕಾ ಸಪ್ತದ್ವೀಪಾ ಚ ಮೇ ದಿನಿ ಸೊ ವಿ ವೇರ್ ಲುಕಿಂಗ್ ಅಟ್ ದಿ ಭಾಷ್ಯ ಒನ್ ಟೂ ಡಾಟ್ ಟೆನ್ ವೇರ್ ಭಗವಾನ್ ಭಾಷ್ಯಕಾರ ರೇಸ್ ದ ಆಬ್ಜೆಕ್ಷನ್ ಪೂರ್ವ ಪಕ್ಷಿ ಸೆಟ್ ದಟ್ ಮೋಕ್ಷ ಇಸ್ ನಾಟ್ ಪಾಸಿಬಲ್ ಟು ಥ್ರೂ ಮಿಯರ್ ಜ್ಞಾನ ಕೇವಲಾತ್ ಜ್ಞಾನಾತ್ ಬಟ್ ಥ್ರೂ ಸಮುಚ್ಚಯ ಸಹ ಸಮುಚ್ಚಯ ಕರ್ಮ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಜ್ಞಾನ ಸೊ ಕರ್ಮ ಶುಡ್ ನಾಟ್ ಬಿ ಗಿವನ್ ಅಪ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಹೀ ಗೇವ್ ಸಮ್ ಎಕ್ಸಾಂಪಲ್ಸ್ ಇನ್ ಉಪನಿಷದ್ ವಾಕ್ಯಸ್ ವಿಚ್ ಹ್ಯಾಸ್ ಬೀನ್ ಡೆಲ್ಟ್ ವಿತ್ ಇನ್ ಗೀತಾ ಇಟ್ ಸೆಲ್ಫ್ ಆಸ್ ಪರ್ ದಿ ಪೂರ್ವ ಪಕ್ಷಿ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ದಟ್ ಈಸ್ ಬೀಂಗ್ ರಿಫ್ಯೂಟೆಡ್ ನೌ ಸೊ ಭಗವಾನ್ ಭಾಷ್ಕರ ಆರ್ ಸೆಟ್ ಪ್ರದಸತ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಹೀ ಸೆಟ್ ದಟ್ ದೇರ್ ಆರ್ ಟೂ ಟೈಪ್ಸ್ ಆಫ್ ಡಿವಿಜನ್ಸ್ ಮೇಡ್ ಇನ್ ಉಪನಿಷತ್ಸ್ ಇನ್ ಉಪನಿಷತ್ ದೇರ್ ಆರ್ ಡಿವಿಜನ್ಸ್ ಮೇಡ್ ಆಸ್ ಟು ಹೂ ಇಸ್ ದಿ ಸಾಧಕ ವೆದರ್ ಇಸ್ ಸಾಧಕ ಅವರ ಜ್ಞಾನಿ ದಟ್ ಈಸ್ ಎ ಡಿಫ್ರೆನ್ಶಿಯೇಷನ್ ದೇರ್ ಸೊ ಕರ್ಮ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಸಾಂಖ್ಯ ದಟ್ ಜ್ಞಾನ ವಿಚ್ ಇಸ್ ಕಾಲ್ಡ್ ಸಾಂಖ್ಯ ಇನ್ ಗೀತಾ ಕರ್ಮ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಜ್ಞಾನ ಡೋಂಟ್ ಗೋ ಟುಗೆದರ್ ಹೀ ಇಸ್ ಎಸ್ಟಾಬ್ಲಿಷಿಂಗ್ ದಟ್ ಥ್ರೂ ಗೀತಾ ಆಸ್ ವೆಲ್ ಆಸ್ ಥ್ರೂ ಉಪನಿಷತ್ ವಾಕ್ಯಸ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಲಾಜಿಕಲಿ ಆಲ್ಸೋ ಹಿಲ್ ಪ್ರೂವ್ ದಟ್ ಇಟ್ ಇಸ್ ನಾಟ್ ಪಾಸಿಬಲ್ ಸೊ ಸೊ ಫಾರ್ ವಿ ಹ್ಯಾವ್ ಸೀನ್ ದಟ್ ವಾಟ್ ಇಸ್ ಸಾಂಖ್ಯ ಬುದ್ಧಿ ಹೂ ಇಸ್ ಸಾಂಖ್ಯ ಹೂ ಇಸ್ ಅ ಯೋಗಿ ಕರ್ಮಯೋಗಿ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ವಾಟ್ ಇಸ್ ಯೋಗ ಬುದ್ಧಿ ನಾವು ಹೀ ಇಸ್ ಹೀ ಶೋನ್ ದಟ್ ದೇರ್ ಆರ್ ಟೂ ಡಿಫ್ರೆಂಟ್ ಪಾತ್ಸ್ ದ್ವೇ ಬುದ್ಧಿ ನಿರ್ದಿಷ್ಟೆ ಟೂ ಕಮಿಟ್ಮೆಂಟ್ಸ್ ಆರ್ ಶೋನ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ದೇರ್ ಫೋರ್ ಟೂ ಡಿಫ್ರೆಂಟ್ ಪಾತ್ಸ್ ಇನ್ ಗೀತಾ ಎಕ್ಸಿಸ್ಟ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಬೋತ್ ವಿಲ್ ಲೀಡ್ ಟು ದಿ ಸೇಮ್ ಗೋಲ್ ಫೈನಲಿ one directly and another indirectly through chitta shuddhi that is the uh, process and that is being shown here so samuchya we do not disagree with samuchya but not sah samuchya krama samuchya there is a sequence now what he is saying is that having shown these two types of commitments uh, in gita he is saying uh, this by not only by bhagwan but what has been said yatha etad vibhaga vachanam in gita how this statement showing division or this teaching showing two divisions similarly tatha eva darshitam shatapati e brahmane and then we saw that uh, sanyasis and uh, san- sanyasis and karma yogis so there you can take karma also need not necessarily be karma yogi karma yogi is one who changes that karma into mechanism to uh, into into means to jnana into uh, karma itself can give karma phala and once you give up the karma phala attachment to karma phala then karma itself becomes yoga and that is the process of gita asking arjuna to follow his own dharma so when bhagwan says uh, uh, yuddhaya kuru nischaya athwa you uh, uh, fight that time it is not a vidhi he is not saying you fight he is saying you follow your own dharma your kshatriya dharma is to fight so bhagwan is not saying you fight otherwise in the end we will see in the end of gita he says that yatha ichchasi tata kuru how you i have taught you what what is right i have taught you jnana i have taught you, taught you yoga now you decide what is right so bhagwan is not forcing him a battle upon him although arjuna initially thinks so but he gives an option in the end having taught what is dharma having removed his confusion he told him what to do is up to you so here you see uh, how that karma becomes karma yoga for arjuna similarly karma can remain karma by giving its phala it can become yoga as sadhana to jnana so the, this is the process and in the end what we saw is that ಏತಮೇವ ಪ್ರೌರಾಜಿನೋ ಲೋಕ ಇಚ್ಛಂತೋ ಬ್ರಾಹ್ಮಣ ಪ್ರೌರಜಂತಿ ಆತ್ಮ
they don't desire other three lokas they desire only atma loka thereby they renounce the world and take to sanyasa iti karma sanyasam vidhaya tachesana kim praja karishyam ye yesham nayam atmayam lokah so yesham uh, noyam atmayam lokah nah so we who are of this type who want only this loka which loka not this world where you guys live in as in uh, uh, jnani says he says that where the entire world stays in not that loka atma i am loka is this which is pratyaksha to me aparoksha to me that atma i am and this atma is the loka for whom for such kind of people who are us what will we do so kim praja karishyamah what will we do with praja getting married be getting children that is the idea of a sanyasi who was a who who's a vairagi iti therefore there are two divisions shown in upanishad which is the source for gita तच्च प्राग दार परिग्रहात पुरुषा आत्मा प्राकृतो धर्म जिज्ञास उत्तर काल लोक त्रय साधन पुत्र सो आई थिंक वी वेट सीन टिल हियर आई जस्ट एक्सप्लेन द मीनिंग नाउ सो व्हाट इज द सेकंड टाइप तत्र च इन उपनिषद इट सेल्फ प्राग दार परिग्रहात बिफोर टेकिंग दार इज वाइफ बिफोर टेकिंग अ वाइफ इज बिफोर गेटिंग मैरिड इन द ब्रह्मचारी एज अ ब्रह्मचारी one who has gone to the gurukula and is studying vedas their purusha atma prakrutah that person considers himself as the, a person uh, the person does not consider himself as atma he considers himself as uh, an unholy mix which we call as jivatma atma and body mind sense complex so prakrutah which is the way we are born naisargika there is a naisargika adhyasa there is a avidya which is there due to that we take ourselves to be anatma and anat so atma and anatma uh, dharmas are attributes are mixed up so called attributes are mixed up and thereby personalities rather anatma and atma become intermingled so that is prakruta atma unrefined one self and atma reflects so i am this purusha that is the idea there before marriage then what happens one becomes two i am the single person and now i become two after marriage then 3 or 4 based on the number of children this is the thinking so dharma jignasa uttara kalam after dharma jignasa dharma jignasa is what it is not brahma jignasa mind you so dharma jignasa and brahma jignasa are two different paths that is also indicated by uh, this word here dharma jignasa uttara kalam dharma jignasa is done in in uh, uh, brahmachari avastha in the gurukula in gurukula not only patha has to be studied although many study only the patha chanting and then they go but dharma jignasa has to be done so the dharma jignasa purva mimamsa starts with what the sutra sutra start with athato dharma jignasa now here after here after now so there after now after studying chanting now let me inquire into dharma what is dharma that is dharma jignasa and uttara kalam after that after the inquiry into dharma once you conclude what has to be done this is dharma i have to do vaidika i have to follow the vaidika dharma i can do only minimal set of karmas as a brahmachari now let me do grahastha karmas for that i need a wife therefore he takes a wife and then i need to beget children this is the dharma dharma jignasa sanyasi has what what inquiry he has uttara mimamsa as his grantha shastra That is Brahma Jidnyasa. Atha to Brahma Jidnyasa. That is Brahma Sutra. So Dharma Jidnyasa Uttara Kalam Lokatraya Sadhanam. There is a means to three lokas. Uh, loka Nam Trayam. Lo, so three lokas. Three lokas are what? This world where a person is born, this Karma Bhumi, Prithvi, and then uh, other lokas as Pitru Loka or as uh, Swarga Ityadi, where Deva Loka. That is Deva Loka. whether a person stays in deva loka or takes birth there as a deva both are possible through upasana ityadi so what are the sadhanas for each of these three lokas putram putram is putra putram begetting a child is a sadhana for what to get manushya janma if a person wants manushya janma he sh- he should beget a child specifically a son it is mentioned but then a child see specifically son means what the son can give आहुति अंतिम आहुति एंड डू श्राद्धा एंड तर्पण बट इट इज नॉट दैट ओनली अ सन अ पर्सन हू हैज ओनली अ सन विल बी शोन बाय शास्त्र यू डू नॉट हैव डॉटर वाई बिकॉज यू हैव नॉट डन कन्यादान 
so people who think that only you know uh, uh, male should be born that is an erroneous thinking yes a son should be there but so should be a daughter uh, uh, you should have a daughter as well why because kanyadana the, there is no punya like kanyadana other way also it is said so it is said generally that a person who does not have a son a male offspring they they say that there is no gati so people get uh, you know they uh, get very depressed but people who have kanya by kanyadana they'll get more uh, punya so there is gati and if a person does not have kanya also people get de depressed but putra is there so it has to be analyzed and understood that is dharma jignasa uttara kalam uh, getting married and begetting children gives what gives this manushya loka of course along with following uh, one swadharma so that is one loka dviprakaram cha vittam what is another sadhana so putram is sadhana then vittam is sadhana vitta is wealth dviprakaram cha vittam what kind of wealth wealth of two types so wealth is twofold not a uh, uh, what is that wealth money money is not the only wealth manusham daivam cha manusham daivam is what manusha vittam daivam vittam cha that is the two types of wealth what is manusha 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 sambandhi manusham and daivam is deva sambandhi both are tadhita what does it mean that which gives you these kind of lokas tatra manusham it is explained further tatra in among these two among manusham and daivam what is that manusham manusham karma roopam pitruloka prapti sadhanam that is karma roopa perform the duties which are given for your varnashrama that is manusha vitta you earn that manusha vitta by doing karma so karma phala karma roopam karma roopam phalam manusham pitruloka prapti sadhanam that becomes the sadhana for attainment prapti of loka which loka pitruloka say world of means so world of ancestors a person gets gati and reaches his own ancestors what is the other vittam and vidyam cha daivam vittam so not only manusha karma see uh, there is you have to do karma and upasana both karma and upasana both are needed if you do only karma there is no phala karma and upasana both one gets a particular kind of loka just upasana one gets deva loka so uh, vidyam cha vidya is here is upasana vidya is upasana Vid so along with vidya which is not atma vidya that is upasana that vidya samuchchaya is possible as in sa samuchchaya is not only possible it is recommended ishavasya upanishad recommends that both should be done together you should not give up one for the other and daivam cha vittam if you attain that kind of uh, upasana phala then that daivam vitta devalokti devaloka prapti sadhanam it becomes a devaloka prapti sadhanam so these are what loka tre sadhanam and when when should these should uh, when should these be followed the sadhana should be followed after dhar, dharma jignasa in brahmachari uh, as a brahmachari in gurukula in brahma brahmachari ashrama and that is proven by an upanishad brahma uh, bhradarnika upanishad uh, mantra so kamayata so so kamayata so if you click here you will go to the upanishad and then uh, we can look up there but uh, so kamayate elsewhere would be ishwara uh, ishwara thought but here it is what it is this brahmachari so kamayate he desired what did he desire iti so kamayate iti uh, we'll just look at the mantra not the bhashya there just show you the mantra what does it say okay, where did it go yeah so kamayata this is so so kamayata jaya mesya jaya is wife jaya mesya let there be a wife for me atha prajaye and then let me beget children atha vittam mesya then let me uh, get wealth as a grahastha Uh, not as a brahmachari brahmachari uh, is studying in the ashram he does not earn any wealth all that bhiksha that he earns is for himself and the gurukula or the guru but only after marriage jaya mesyad atha prajaya let me earn wealth 
वित्तम्य स्याद अथ कर्म कुरुई इत्यादि सो ऑल दैट फॉलोज सो आफ्टर धर्म इन दी ब्रह्मचारी आश्रम अर्थ एंड काम आफ्टर दैट इन दी गृहस्थ आश्रम देन मोक्ष इज फॉर सन्यासी दिस इज हाउ द डिविजन इज एंड इट इज थ्रू थ्रू वान प्रस्थ आश्रम सो दिस इज दिस सेटअप नाउ वॉट डज ही से भगवान भाष्यकर शोज दैट सो कामयत अविद्या कामवत एव सर्वाणी कर्माणी श्रोता श्रोतादीनि दर्शिता दर्शिता दे आर शोन वॉट आर शोन श्रोतादीनि श्रोता श्रोत स्मार्त श्रुति बेस्ड एंड स्मृति बेस्ड कर्म कर्माणी सर्वाणी कर्माणी ऑल कर्माज आर शोन फॉर हूम फॉर सो काम सो कामयत मीन सह अकामयत ही डिजायर्ड हू इज दैट ही डिजायर्ड फॉर वन टू डिजायर देर हेज टू बी अविद्या otherwise one cannot consider oneself as a person limited and wanting something else therefore avidya kamavatah one who has avidya and thereby kama then only karma is possible what is the chain avidya is there then kama is there that avidya leads to kama kama leads to karma karma leads to karma phala karma phala leads to vasana vasana continues the avidya a person is born again with set of desires fructifying as prarabdha Set, uh, the circumstantially as well as the desires uh, man, uh, manifesting as kama again then again avidya continuing kama continues kama continues karma continues karma phala continues and so on is the vicious circle that is samsara so avidya kama vatahayo matu so this is a person one who avidya kama wan for an avidya kama wan one who has avidya and kama for that kind of person only this mantra saha akamayata shows that what what does it show for that person alone sarvani karmani bhavanti bhavanti darshitani darshitani they are shown all these karmas all karmas what kind of karma shrauta smart therefore shrautadi shrautadini darshitani shrautadini sarvani karmani darshitani where in this in this upanishad mantra under this 1417 mantra in bhradharanaka upanishad tebhya vithaya what about others who are not desirous because of avidya going avidya has gone therefore kama has no place if kama has no place where from karma will arise therefore tebhya vithaya giving from them renouncing those pravithaya pravrajanti having given up those pravrajanti ithi vithanam atmanam eva lokam ichchatah for here for a avidya kama vata on the other hand what is the other path ichchata ichchata for a person desiring he does not have kama there is also there is a desire what desire is there atmanam eva lokam only atma loka that is different from this three lokas lokatraya is what lokatraya is sadhana for something else one loka this manushya loka second loka pitr loka third loka devata loka what else is there so they don't have anything other than these three lokas and that is samsaranam to come out of that atma loka which is which is me already i don't have to earn any loka if i desire only my own swarupa therefore what does he say tebhya vyuthaya having renounced pravrajanti take to sanyasa iti vyuthanam it this this renunciation is what atmanam eva lokam ichchata for one who desires nothing but atma only atma evakara is there not that atma also and then this lokatraya sadhana thereby three lokas also not those therefore karma and jnana cannot go together and who is that ichchata lokam ichchata atmanam eva loka ichchata ichcha ichchavan one who desires actually ichchata is it is satranta so desiring who is that one who is desiring shakti ek vachana which is in samana dekrana akamasya atmanam eva lokam ichchatah akamasya uh, jnaninah for a person or jnaninah there you can say sadaka also sadakasya but akamasya one who has sadana chatushte sampatti for that kind of person who has vairagya in great measure he does not desire anything but only so mumukshatvam is complete thereby akamasya what tebhya vyuthaya pravrajanti iti vihitam 
Vihitam, this is a vidhi. It has been, it is prescribed. What is prescribed? Pravrajanti. Pravrajanti is Latlakara. But Latlakara in Vedas is seen as, uh, as vidhiling. Vidhiling or lot where it is a vidhi. Therefore, Vihitam, it is prescribed and thereby a person who gives up and takes sannyasa, anyway he does not have any adhikara in karma. Only then he gives up. Tad etan vibhagavachanam anupapannam syad yadi shrota karma jnanayo samuchayaha avipreta syad bhagavataha. Now, he says, this Bhagavan who gave the Gita, same Bhagavan has given this Upanishads also, entire Vedas also. So, tad etad vibhagavachanam, this kind of a, uh, the statements of division showing karma and jnana as separate for those who desire the results of karma and jnana. Desire, uh, those who desire lokatraya, they have this karma sadhana. Those who desire atma loka, they have the uh, sannyasa as a vidhi. Therefore, this vibhaga vachanam, anupapannam, untenable, it would be illogical, syad would be illogical, yadi, if shrauta karma jnanayo samuchaya avipretaha syad bhagavataha. So, bhagavataha vachanam, this statement of Bhagavan of showing division, statement of teachings, these teachings of Bhagavan through Upanishads and Gita would be illogical, had he intended samuchayaha combination of what shrauta karma jnana yoho of karma, shruti based karma and jnana if shruti based or uh, here specifically shruti based he will talk about shruti based also it is included here but since he has shown only uh, here in the end he has shown upanishad therefore he is saying shrauta karma so it is not possible Otherwise, Bhagavan, uh, it would be illogical. Bhagavan's statements would be illogical in Upanishads as well as in Gita. Further, he says, now, so this is one way he has already established. He does not stop there. Bhagavan Bhashyakara will show in all possible ways how erroneous the conclusion of Purva Pakshi is. He says, Nacha Arjunasya Prashna Upapanna Bhavati. Not only Bhagavan would be making illogical statements. Now you look at it from Arjuna's perspective. He says, Gita, go back to Gita, Nacha Arjunasya Prashna, Arjuna, Arjuna's question also, Upapanna na bhavati. It would also not be tenable. What is that question? Jayasi chet karmanaste. What is that shloka? He says further, Jayasi chet karmanaste, mata buddhi janardana. So there is a shloka in third chapter. After this Sankhya has been taught, as in Sankhya Yoga in the second chapter has been taught, in third chapter opening, first shloka itself, Bhagavan has finished his teaching actually, second chapter is a complete teaching rather, whatever has to be taught in the entire Gita has been taught in the second chapter, very beautiful chapter, the complete Gita is taught there really, and Bhagavan says I have already taught. Now, unless you have a question, I don't have any other teaching to give you. I have taught you what has to be taught. But Arjuna raises a question. What is that? Jayasi chet karmanaste. Jayasi means, if you consider Shre Mata, so Mata Buddhi, Te Buddhi, Te Buddhi Mata. If you, if as per you, as per you, if it is uh, intended, as per your thinking, if it is intent in your view, so in your view, as per your view, if it is, uh, if, chet, if, karmanaha uh, buddhi, sorry, in your thing, mata buddhi hi, karmanaha uh, jayasi chet mata. So buddhi mata, buddhi is considered, in your view, te, te is tava, tava mata, in your, even your consideration, if buddhi, buddhi is what? This Sankhya buddhi. Sankhya buddhi, Sankhya buddhi as in this jnana, jnana yoga. If jnana yoga is karmanaha, karmanaha is panchami ekvachana, karmanaha karma yoga. Karma yoga or karma also. You can take as karma, but for Arjuna it is karma yoga finally. So karma, if, if as per you buddhi is better than karma, jayasi superior, meaning what? Jnana yoga is better than karma yoga. 
what does that mean from Arjuna's perspective the question is if you say that jnana is better than karma he may have very well asked karma is better than jnana or jnana is better than karma however it is but he is asking with a division already made in third chapter opening how can he raise such a question if in the second chapter had Bhagavan taught samuchaya if Bhagavan has taught both to be done together karma and jnana together why would Arjuna ask if you consider jnana as super, superior to karma it is illogical no student would th think like that no student worth his salt so what is he saying Nacha Arjuna se prashna upapanno bhavati jayasi chet karmanaste ityadi and further ahead in this shloka Eka purushanushtaya tva sambhavam buddhi karmano bhagavata punar uh, sorry purvam anuktam katham Arjuna Arjuna ha ashrutam buddhesha karmano jayastam bhagavati adhyaropa yan murusha eva he says jayasi chet karmanaste mata buddhi iti murusha eva that kind of fo incorrect thinking, erroneous thinking as to eka purush, purusha anushtayatva asambhavam buddhi karmano ho what is that? buddhi karmano ho eka purusha purushena e, ekasya purushena by one purusha by one purusha eka, eka yo purusha so by one purusha eka ha, e, ekena purushena ekena purushena anushtayatva asambhavam impossibility of being practiced by a single person, same person. What is that practice of what? Buddhi and karma. Mean jnana and karma. That is jnana karma samuchya. If Bhagavan, Bhagavata, by Bhagavan, Purvam Anuktam. What is that? Anuktam means not said. What has not been taught by Bhagavan? If Bhagavan had not taught, by Bhagavan had it not been taught earlier, what impossibility of buddhi and karma? I mean, jnana and karma, it is impossible to practice jnana and karma together by one same person, same one and only person who is a sadhaka or a jnani, but he is a sadhaka and a jnani now because he is doing karma as well as jnana. Whether sadhaka or not, he is a jnani. A jnani, he is following jnana as well as karma together here not jnani sorry jnana jnana yoga so jnana yoga and karma yoga is following together now uh, we'll see what this means eka purusha anushtayatva sambhavam what is he saying i have already explained what bhagwan means this bhagwan bhashyakara is saying he is saying that it is impossible to follow jnana and karma together Puro Pakshi is saying, in fact, Bhagavan is saying both have to be followed together for what? For moksha, mind you. So that should be the perspective. Moksha will result only when karma and jnana are followed together. Bhagavan Bhashyakara is showing that Advaita Vedanta, in Advaita Vedanta, which is the concluded meaning of Gita, Bhagavan is saying that both are impossible to be done by the same and same person together. Saha Samuchya is impossible. Now, if we take your perspective, hypothetically, had Bhagavan not taught that it is impossible, had Bhagavan not said that it is impossible to do to follow both together, then if it is not said, so Puro Vanuktam, he has not said that, that's what your uh, Puro Pakshi is Aropa is. Bhagavan has not said that uh, it is impossible to follow both together. In fact, Bhagavan is saying follow both together. So if Bhagavan, now we will say that had he not said impossible, why? Because we are saying, Bhagavan is saying it is impossible. That is, that is, that is our opening statement. It is impossible to do. Not possible, you cannot follow Jnana and Karma together. Now, if it is impossible, Bhagavan has not made such a statement, has not showed impo impossibility then which is not stated by Bhagavan then how can Katham Arjunaha Ashrutam Buddhehecha Karmanoho Jayastam between Buddhi Buddhehecha Karmanoho Madhye between Buddhi and Karma as in Jnana and Karma Ashrutam unheard he is, it has not been taught by Bhagavan Bhagavata Anuktam Purvam so it is not told by Bhagavan it is impossible then how can Arjuna ask which is unheard 
He is not heard that it is impossible. Since Bhagavan has not said as per Puro Pakshi, then between uh, buddhi and karma, jayastam, what, which is superior between the two, how can such a thinking arise? If said that thinking arises, then what would that mean? Bhagavati Adhyaropayet. How would Arjuna Adhyaropayet, how would Arjuna superimpose project? How would Arjuna super, superimpose that or project that thought onto Bhagavan, Bhagavati, on Bhagavan? What is that? Which is which is better than the two? You are, you tell me which is better of the two? Which is better among the two? And that is seen by this statement. Jayasi, Mirushaeva. It is erroneous thinking that Aropa that you are making, Arjuna is making on Bhagavan. That is what it would amount to mean. So Jayasi chet karmanasse matabuddhi iti. That would be Mirushaeva. Uh, Murushayo Bhavati, that would be erroneous thinking. This is another way. Further, Kincha, moreover, Yadi Buddhi Karmano ho Sarvesham Samuche Uktasyat, Arjuna Syapi Saukta Evaiti. He says, then, not only that, as in moreover, continuing that thinking, what Bhagavan is, uh, Bhagavan Bhashyakara is showing, Yadi Buddhi Karmano Sarvesham Samuche Uktasyat. Had, had it been told, as in your perspective, now we are we have seen our perspective being impossible. With that hypothesis, we have uh, as an impossibility not being told. As in uh, Siddhanti, we will say Siddhanti and Pura Paksha. Siddhanti is Advaita Vedanti. So Siddhanti Paksha is what impossibility of both together being taught by Gita, by Bhagavan. Now, had this not been taught, that we have seen in this this paragraph here, this this statement has refuted that. Then Arjuna's Arjuna's question, which is superior of the two, would be erroneous. That would not be there, but he has asked. Therefore, anyata upapatti, arthapatti. Otherwise, not possible. He would not think something which Bhagwan has not stated. That would be superimposing some uh, something on Bhagwan projection. Kincha, moreover, Yadi Buddhi Karmano Sarvesham Samuche Uktasya. This is your perspective. Now, if Puro Pakshi's perspective will take that combination of jnana and karma has had been taught. Yadi, if ha, had it been taught, Sarvesham for everyone. You are saying that it is true for everyone because that is moksha sadhana. Then Arjuna Syapisa Uktaeva. So it is taught for Arjuna also. Arjuna is one of us, everyone. So it is taught for Arjuna also. Then Yachre Yeta Yorekam Tanme Bruhi Sunichitam Iti Katham Ubhayo Upadeshe Sati Anyatara Visheva Prashnasyat. Now he is saying, take another shloka. In the fifth chapter, opening again. Fourth chapter, Bhagavan ended the teaching. Fifth chapter again, Arjuna asks a question. He is still confused. What is he asking? Yachreya, which is better again. Jayasi Chet and Yachreya have same meaning. Etayor ekam tanme bruhi, meaning what in third chapter and fourth chapter till fourth chapter end, Bhagavan uh, uh, Krishna just took him around. He taught him but did not give him a clear answer. He said, see, karma yoga this way, jnana yoga this way, uh, these people who do this, they, I mean, he has told the division, he has talked about division, that's why there is a division. He is saying, you, where do you belong? He is trying to show that he wants Arjuna to conclude as to where he belongs. He, so therefore Arjuna has said what? Tvam, uh, tvam prapannam, tvam prapannam maam, Sha, shadi maam, tvam prapannam. You teach me who has taken refuge unto you. But Bhagavan is not giving him any answer straight that, okay, you do this. He is not doing that. You have to decide. If I tell you tomorrow, you will say, okay. I am unable to do. Not that way. You have to think. I will show you the way, says Bhagavan. Therefore, Yachreya etayor ekam tat me bruhim. You tell me, you, to me, you tell me only one thing. Sunishchitam. You tell me one thing. Even after that, actually, Bhagavan has not given a clear answer. If you see uh, answer there, he says, for you, karma yoga. If I have to tell for you, not for everyone. Tan me bruhi. You tell me which is better among the two, but for whom? 
for me arjuna is not interested in the world's welfare really as in moksha wise he is interested in his own moksha but you tell me what should i do therefore tan tat me bruhi you tell me what sunishchitam among the two yashreya sunishchitam me bruhi just decide by yourself and ascertain which is better of the two yashreya better of the two etayoho ekam don't tell me karma is also good jnana is also good don't confuse me further i am already confused but he is asking which is better meaning what he, there are two paths that is very well established so kinche yadi buddhi karmano sarvesham samuchya uktasya arjunasya api sa ukte vaiti therefore yachre etayor ekam tanme bruhi tell me one which is better of the two not this is also okay uh, puju swami used to you know joke about it ye bhi chalta hai wo bhi chalta hai not that way this is also okay that is also okay no you tell me one and uh, puju swami used to further joke that you know krishna still had you know the while wrestling uh, put oil so you slip krishna is slipping he is not getting the idea arjuna is not getting an idea as to what really should i do सो इति कथम उभयोर उपदेश सती उभयोर उपदेश सती मीन्स वॉट बुद्धि कर्मण बोथ हैव बीन टोल्ड ज्ञान एंड कर्म दैट इज एज पर दी पूर्व पक्षी बोथ हैव बीन टोल्ड देर फोर सती सप्तमी कथम हाउ इज इट दैट उभयो उपदेश सती वेन द टीचिंग ऑफ बोथ हैज बीन गिवन एज इन यू डू बोथ एज पर दी पूर्व पक्षी इफ दैट इज द केस वेन दैट हैज बीन ऑलरेडी टॉट इन दी first four first three chapter uh, second third and fourth chapters then in fifth chapter how can anyatara vishayo prashna syat anyatara vishay means among the two which is better that kind of question cannot arise nahi now he gives an example how is it that if you go to a doctor and doctor in the sense in a vaidika setup it is an ayurvedic doctor so you have a pitta pitta dosha so there is there is a pitta or a Uh, you know uh, the, the, the on the three there is an imbalance so kapha pitta in that he has pitta so pitta prashamnarthinah vaidyena madhuram sheetalancha bhoktavyam iti upadeshte sati tayoho anyatara anyatarat pitta prashamana karanam bruhi iti prashna sambhavati a, a patient goes to a doctor and he says i have pitta and doctor ascertains that he has pitta does takes the nadi and he says okay you have pitta so pitta prashamanarthinah one who is desirous arthi he is an arthi means he is he is desirous what is he desirous of he is desirous of pitta prashanam that pitta should reduce for that kind of pitta is acidity so to reduce that what should be done vaidyena madhuram sheetalancha bhoktavyam iti upadishte sati when the, when the doctor one it has been told by the doctor vaidyena what has been told bhoktavyam what should be eaten by you madhuram sheetalancha chakara is there sahasamuchaya together madhuram sweet you should be eating and sheetalam sheetalam is basically not hot food hot food will increase acidity uh, pitta so as in something which will be soothing so uh, uh, something that will Uh, calm down your pitta that kind of sweet and soothing food you should be eating not spicy food uh, which will increase pitta therefore madhuram sheetalam cha both you should be taking you eat some sweet and eat uh, soothing food when both have been prescribed as bhoktavyam should be done it should be eaten iti upadishte sati when it has been taught taught as what directed by doctor prescribed by doctor tayo ho anyatar between the two which pitta prashamana karana which will uh, will be pitta prashamana karana madhuram or sheetalam that kind of a thing uh, is not right to be asked you know it is illogical to ask when doctor has prescribed both you ask the doctor again doctor should i take madhura or sheetala which will be the cause for my pitta prashamana you won't ask that kind of question so uh, tayo ho anyatar pitta prashamana karanam bruhi please tell me iti prashna sambhavati na sambhavati was nahi sambhavati indeed na sambhavati na will go with sambhavati prashna uh, iti prashna na sambhavati that kind of just like a patient cannot ask which is which of the two when both have been prescribed by the doctor similarly when krishna as a doctor 
has prescribed, the teacher is prescribed, do jnana and karma both, then Arjuna cannot ask now as a patient in the simile, he cannot ask that which of the, you tell me which is better of the two. Yachreya etayoho ekam yachreya tatme bruhi. Sunishchitam bruhi. You tell me definitely which is better. That kind of question cannot arise. Now let's say, let's say, further he is analyzing, look at the beauty of Bhashyakara. He is saying, let's say Arjuna still is a dullard. Okay. He is one of us. Not everyone understands. Patient still asks the doctor which is better. So Bhagwan will say, uh, doctor will say what if he, even if he let's say that patient is a dullard, he asks what would the doctor say? Hey, I told you take both. Why are you asking one of the two? Take both. Take both. This is what the answer would be. Atha. So now that kind of paksha is being analyzed. Atha. Arjuna sya. भगवद उक्त वचनार्थ विवेक विवेक अनवधारण निमित्त प्रश्न कल्पित जस्ट इन केस यू से दैट अर्जुना इज डलर्ड सो अर्जुन से प्रश्न कल्पित इफ यू इमेजिन अर्जुना क्वेश्चन इफ इफ वी वेर टू इमेजिन व्हाट कैंड ऑफ प्रश्न भगवद उक्त वचनार्थ विवेक न विवेक अनवधारण निमित्त प्रश्न विच इज ड्यू टू नॉट बींग एबल टू एसरटेन with discrimination as to what is the idea of that statement of Bhagavata, of Bhag Bhagavan. So what is the teaching of Bhagavan, he still did not understand. Let's say he is a dullard and still there is a prashna. So we say that, as in Puro Pakshi, let's say he argues that, no, Arjuna's, Arjuna may have still asked, he may not have understood, so what? Bhagavan didn't say that, Bhagavan said, Samasa Samuchaya. Arjuna didn't understand, so he asked Jaya Si Chet, he still didn't understand in third and fourth chapter, he asked uh, Sunishchitam Bruhi, Tanmay Bruhi, Eta Yoho, Yachreya Eto Ekam Tanmay Bruhi Sunishchitam, does not mean that Bhagavan has not taught Sa Samuchya, it just means that Arjuna did not understand. If that is the case, Tathapi, still what? Bhagavata Prashnanu Rupam Prativachanam Deyam, then Bhagavata Bhai Bhagavan Tritiyayak Vachanam, Prativachanam Deyam. Prativachana is answer. Answer Deyam should be given. What kind of answer should be given by Bhagavan? Prashna Anurupam. Anurupam. In keeping with what Prashna? In keeping with the question should be the answer. You ask me how to go to Kashi and I tell you Rameshwara is not right. Maya buddhi karmano ho samuchaya uktaha kimartham itham tvam bhranto asiti. And what should be that Prativachanam? Prashna Anurupam Prativachanam. What should be that teaching? What should be that answer in keeping with the question? He has asked, which is better of the two? And what should be the answer? I have already taught you that uh, you should follow both. So, maya buddhi karmano ho samuchaya uktaha. What has been taught by me? Samuchaya, combination of uh, jnana and karma has been taught by me. Kimartham itham tvam bhranto asi. Why are you, as in not a question, a rhetoric. Kimartham itham tvam bhranto asi, bhranta, why are you, bhranta asi, tvam bhranta asi, why are you, kimartham, for what reason are you so confused? You are deluded. I have told you follow both and you are asking me, tell me definitely which is better of the two. What kind of a question is this? So pay attention, that should be the answer. However, what did Bhagavan say? Natupuna prativachanam ananurupam prashtadanya deva. Natupuna prativachanam ananurupam. Ananurupam, Ananurupam, Ananurupam Prativachanam Na Deyam, Prashna Prativachanam Ananurupam, Ananurupam means following, in keeping with, in keeping with Prashna, Prashna Anurupam, in keeping with is Prashna Anurupam, Ananurupam is what? Not in keeping, but the answer should not be against or tangential or opposite to what has been asked, completely Unrelated answer you cannot give. Natu punaha prativachanam ananurupam prashtadanyad. Other than what has been asked. Prashtad is what has been asked. What has been asked? What has been asked? Prashna anurupam prativachanam. Answer should be in keeping with that. And what should be that answer? This has been said. This way. But the answer is not at all. It would not at all be related to the question. Had he taught samuchaya. What is the answer he gives? 
द्वे निष्ठे मया पुरा प्रोक्ते इति वक्तुम युक्तम हैड ही सो दिस इज एक्चुअली नॉट इन दर्ड एंड फोर्थ चैप्टर सो वॉट डज ही से द्वे निष्ठे मया पुरा प्रोक्ते he gives the answer so 3.1 he has asked the question here jayasi chet karmanaste mata buddhi 3.1 answer is given in 3.3 not after yachreya but after this first question which are similar first and this 3.1 and 5.1 are similar but what is the answer in 3.3 jayasi chet karmanaste mata buddhi if you consider jnana uh, as better than karma bhagavan says what dve nishte maya prokte to have been taught to have been taught Samuchaya has not been taught. Two different have been taught, and then he is telling which is better than the two. He is starting that answer there. He is saying two different commitments are there based on the commitments you follow. Therefore, when he says still two are there, that time in the fifth chapter he says I still don't get it. Which is better for me? You are telling me two are there, two are there, two are there. Tell me which one should I follow? So, Bhagwan has not told him which is better for you. and he has definitely not said follow both so that kind of answer he has given what ka, so you can say arjuna is a dullard what about bhagwan he is bhagwan he cannot give a give a, a unthought answer or a illogical or untenable answer he is giving an answer because that is what he has taught he has not taught samuchya he has taught two different nishthas नापि स्मार्ते नैव कर्मणा बुद्धे समुच्चे अभिप्रेते विभाग वचनादि सर्व upapannam now if you say okay shruti karma has not been taught samuchaya with jnana of but smarta karma can be done should be done so here he says na api smarte neva karuna buddhe samuchaya viprete aviprete sati if had it had samuchaya had combination of buddhi with karma which jnana with karma what kind of karma smarta karma with smarta karma if it smriti based karma बुद्धि समुच्चय एज इन ज्ञान एंड स्मार्त कर्म समुच्चय कॉम्बिनेशन हैड बीन टॉट इंटेंडेड अभिप्रेते सती इफ हैड इट बीन इंटेंडेड व्हेन इट इज इंटेंडेड विभाग वचनादि सर्व उपपन्न न भवती न भवती एंड इवन अपी एंड इवन अलोंग विथ स्मार्त कर्म इफ ज्ञान हैड बीन टॉट एंड इंटेंडेड सो देन ऑल्सो विभाग वचन देर के नॉट बी डिविजन division would not be tenable but division has been taught i have established that so smarta karma also you cannot say you can do samuchaya with or you have to do samuchaya with for moksha kinche moreover kshatriyasya yuddham smartam karma swadharmah iti janatah janatah is shashti ek vachana shatranta of one who meaning one who is knowing for one who is knowing who is that arjunah अर्जुन से क्षत्रिय से क्षत्रिय से अर्जुन से अर्जुन हु इज क्षत्रिय फॉर हिम हु इज जानन हु नोज व्हाट डज ही नो इति ही नोज इन दिस मैनर हाउ युद्धम क्षत्रिय से फॉर अ क्षत्रिय युद्धम स्मार्तम कर्म स्वधर्म इति जानता और यू कैन से क्षत्रिय से युद्धम स्मार्तम कर्म स्वधर्म व्हाट इज दी स्वधर्म फॉर स्वधर्म इति जानता वन हु नोज स्वधर्म व्हाट डज ही नो स्वधर्म एज युद्धम एंड स्मार्तम कर्म युद्ध युद्धम स्मार्तम कर्म बोथ युद्ध एंड स्मार्त कर्म इति जानता एज इन युद्ध युद्ध इज प्रिस्क्राइब फॉर हिम स्मार्त कर्म यू कैन टेक दैट इट सेल्फ ए स्मार्त कर्म तत्किम कर्मणि घोरे माम नियोजयसी इति उपलंब देर इज नो देर इज नो चकार हियर युद्ध इज स्मार्त कर्म सो दे आर इन सामनाधिकरण्यम स्मृति स्पीच युद्ध फॉर अ क्षत्रिय सो क्षत्रिय से युद्ध स्मार्त कर्म स्वधर्म जानता एंड स्मार्त यू कैन इवन टेक सम क्षत्रिय कर्म लाइक सम कैंड ऑफ रिचुअल्स विच आर निषिद्ध फॉर ब्राह्मण एंड अदर्स बट अ क्षत्रिय कैन डू दैट राइट राजस्व सो राजस्व विच ही हेज बीन डन बाय युधिष्ठर दैट ओनली क्षत्रिय इज एलिजिबल टू डू ब्राह्मण कैन नॉट डू दैट सो क्षत्रिय से युद्ध स्मार्त कर्म स्वधर्म जानता सो युद्ध इज इज ओन स्वधर्म ही नोज इट and for that kind of person janatah tatkim karmani ghore mam niyojesi iti upalambho anupapannah iti upalambha upalambha is uh, illogical thinking you know erroneous erroneous conclusion anupapannah that kind of thinking is untenable because he is a janan he knows 
फॉर अ पर्सन हू नो स्वधर्म दैट कड क्षत्रिय वॉट इज क्षत्रिय कर्म ही नोज इज अ किंग नॉट ओनली अ क्षत्रिय बट अ किंग और प्रिंस और हाउ एवर यू वॉन्ट टू पुट इट वेरी यू नो दे हैव अ किंगडम दे आर फाइटिंग फॉर देअर ओन किंगडम इति उपालंभो अनुपन्न ऑल दो युधिष्ठिरा वुड बी किंग इफ इफ यू कॉल अ किंग द ज्येष्ठ पुत्र बट इति उपालंभो अनुपन्न दैट इज ऑल्सो नॉट टेनेबल दैट ही गेट्स कन्फ्यूज दैट क्षत्रिय कर्म इट इज देअर आई शुड नॉट बी डू डूइंग दिस कैंड ऑफ अ कर्म ही के नॉट आस्क तत्किम कर्मणी घोरेव नियोजित ही नोज इट इज हिज कर्तव्य धर्म ही के नॉट आस्क तत्किम कर्मणी घोरेव नियोजित ही इज आस्किंग हाउ कैन ही आस्क दैट तत्किम कर्मणी घोरेव दैट इज स्मार्त कर्म तत्किम कर्मणी घोरेव नियोजे सी इट इज अ प्रिस्क्राइब ड्यूटी ही नोज इज स्वधर्म वाय वुड ही आस्क दैट इफ इट इज ही ऑलरेडी नोज दैट He is saying, "What is that? Tatkim karmani ghore maam niyojesi. Why do niyojesi? Oh, hey, Bhagwan, hey Krishna, not Bhagwan, hey Krishna. Why are you niyojesi? Why are you prodding me to maam? Prodding me to what? Ghore karmani. Kim tat ghore karmani uh, maam niyojesi? Why are you asking me to fight this, you know, terrible war?" this ghor karma you are making me do why are you doing that this kind of a thinking also would not be right for a person who knows what is his duty therefore this sah samuchcha and all is not right tasmad gita shastre ishan matrena api shrotena smartena va karmana atma jnanasya samuchya na kena chit darshetum shakya kena chit api darshetum na shakya it is not possible to be shown by any one logically it cannot be shown by anyone why not logically as in our logic is based on shruti and smruti shruti and smruti viruddha that kind of a logic it would be if you were if anyone were to be showing and we talk to which kind of people we discuss with only vaidikas only those who have nishtha in vedas that vedas are talking about good what is shreya for manushyas they are talking dharma they are talking about moksha therefore kena chid api darshetum na shakya what is not possible to be shown by anyone samuchchaya samuchchaya of what combination of what atmajnana se karmana sah of atmajnana combination of atmajnana with karma what kind of karma shrotena smartena va karmana along with karma which whether it is shruti based or smruti based and sasma therefore he has said gita shastra in gita shastra ishan matrena api not only karma which is shrauta or smarta karma complete even a little let him do a little not possible it is not possible to be shown by anyone combination in gita there has been a combination has been taught and combination with little let him do little karma not possible even little karma is not possible ishan matra means even a little not even a little na kena chit darshetum shakya yasya tu ajnanat ragadi doshavato va karmani pravrutasya yajnena danena tapasava vishuddha sattvasya jnanam upapannam paramartha tattva vishayam what is that yasya tu for a person this is showing the jnana what is that atma jnana yasya tu yasya kasya whoever for whoever to ajnana due to ajnana ragadi doshavatah va karmani pravruttasya for a person who is initially ajnana due to ajnana ajnana karana due to ajnana which he is engaged who is engaged pravruttasya yasya pravruttasya Yes, say, for a person who is pravrutta, who is engaged, engaged in what karma, karmani in karma, due to ajnana, he is because we have shown avidya kama karma. So ajnana kama and then by karma, raga doshadi vataha va, ajnana t raga doshadi vataha va for a person who raga di dosha. There is ajnana and kama is what raga, raga di raga. dvesha ityadi dosha these are doshas for a person who is endowed doshavan so uh, sorry doshata not dosha doshavata doshata ajnanat ragadi doshavatah va means what due to ajnana or due to under the influence doshata uh, doshata is uh, tasil doshata 
due to. So due to this dosha, tritiyarthi tasil you can take. Due to ragadi dosha. So adhyana ragadi dosha tahava. Due to adhyana not knowing. Not knowing, basic adhyana is not knowing one's own swarupa, knowing oneself as someone else. Therefore what ragadi dosha. Actually this is a, the mool karana is adhyana. But raga, one does not even go to trace back adhyana. Ragadi dosha. Ragadi dosha is there, one does not know what, I, what have I been, I mean what have I taken birth for, therefore Ajnana is there, does not know what is Parama Purushartha, what has to be done in this life itself, or Ragadi dosha is there, cannot control Raga and Dvesha, no, no, I, I love this person, I have to do, I hate this person, I cannot do or I, I, I want to do something and, you know, uh, somehow, you know, get happiness out of even, uh, jealousy, ityadi, krodha, whatever it is, I should, you know, not have this raga which is taking away my happiness or dvesha which is taking away happiness, anger, etc. All these have to be uh, dealt with. So, person who thinks that, what will you do? Yasya to, due to that, for that person, karmani pravrutasya. Due to that, he is engaged in karma. Whether it is vaidika karma, laukika karma, he is engaged in that karma to meet his ragadi dosha or due to ajnana. Yajnana danena tapasava, what happens is sequentially, this person is doing karma now. How does it convert into karma yoga, same karma, vaidika karma, even laukika? Yajnana danena tapasa. So, yajna, by prescribed yajna, whatever, shruti or smriti based yajna, dana, so dana can be both types. Shruti prescribed, there can be some laukik also. Tapasa, tapasa definitely, uh, tapa is prescribed by, by uh, Shruti and Smriti. So, by any of these or all of these or combination of yajnana, dhanena, tapasa va vishuddha sattvasya. Vishuddha sattvasya is a bhauri, vishuddha sattva yasya. Vishuddha sattvam yasya, sattvam is manaha, antakkaranam. So, vishuddham sattvam yasya. One who has antakkarana which is vishuddha, by what? Tapasa, by tapaha. Dhanena by dana by yajna. Any or more of these. One or more of these. Then this fellow becomes a karma yogi now. The yajnana dhanena tapasa has become a karma yogi. Vishuddha sattva, that is the result of that. Jnanam utpannam. Then this jnana is born for this person. He goes to a guru, he studies and then he understands. So jnanam utpannam, it is now aparoksha jnana is born. What is that jnana? What is the vishaya of that jnana? Subject matter, not uh, any kind of non jnana as in all darshanas, science, you know, none of these. Paramartha tattva vishayam, that jnana which deals with the reality of paramartha, what is the highest knowledge? That is the highest knowledge which is atma tattva. And what is that knowledge? Further it is said, Ekam eva idam sarvam brahma akartrucha. So, ekam eva idam sarvam brahma akartrucha. Ekam eva, only one. What is that? Idam sarvam. All this is only one and that is brahma sarvam brahma. All this is nothing but brahma. There is nothing other than brahma. That's what it means. There is nothing other than brahma and that brahma is akartru. Akartru is neuter because brahma is neuter. And finally, I am that. Paramartha Tattva is only one and if it is only one, how can there be world and, uh, uh, and Paramartha Tattva? Therefore, Ekam is Sarvam. Sarvam is hidden. Jagat is also one with, one with Brahma and Jagat includes everything. How can I be separate? Therefore, I, my family, my uh, uh, friends and enemies, my relatives, family and relatives, friends and enemies, all of those, there is no scope for Ragadi Dosha. Because he is akar through and that I am because I cannot be different from that Brahma which is one. Otherwise it would be at least more than one. There will be Brahma which is Jagat and I am separate. Not that way. It is ekam eva. Therefore, iti jnanam paramartha tattva vishayam jnanam utpannam yasya kasya api for whoever tasya for him tasya karmani karma prayojane cha nivrutte api Loka Sangra Artham Yatna Purvam Yatha Pravrutti Hi Tathaya Pravruttasya Yat Pravrutti Rupam Drishyate Natat Karma Yena Buddhe Samuchya Syat So, we will see this further, but I will just tell you some shape of this. For whom this, this understanding is born, this knowledge is arisen, Tasya for him, 
कर्मणी कर्म प्रयोजने च इन कर्म एंड इन वॉट कर्म फला कर्म प्रयोजन इज फला च निवृत्ते वेन तस् कर्मणी कर्म प्रयोजने च निवृत्ते वेन कर्म नॉट कर्मणी इन कर्म सती सप्तमी कर्मणी कर्म प्रयोजने च निवृत्ते सती वेन कर्म एंड कर्म प्रयोजन बोथ हैव गॉन He does not have any karma. He does not have karma prayojana. Means he has taken to sannyasa. He should be taken to sannyasa. Api, even when that kind of a uh, state has arrived, at, as in such a circumstance has arrived, or he has reached loka sangrar tam yatna purvam yatha pravrti earlier yatna purvam with yatna with effort effortfully effortfully loka sangrar tam yatha pravrti he. For the purpose of the world, loka sangrahartha means for the purpose of for the welfare of the world. Generally, we say for the welfare of the world. Yatna purom yatha prorti. How he would engage with effort? Tatha eva similarly. Tatha eva prorutasya yat prorti roopam drishyate. Similarly, for a person, this kind of a prorti roopa. He you see the person is engaged in karma. Although if, when there is a nyanotpati, still you see a person is engaged in karma. What drishyate? What is seen? Not that karma. That is not karma at all. Bhagwan will say further. Bhagwan Bhaskara will say that is karma bhasa. It is an. It is just a semblance of karma. It is an appearance of karma. It is not really karma. It is from the onlookers' perspective that it is called karma, but it is not karma because the onlooker does not know any better. He doesn't know any better. Not that karma. That is not karma with which ye na buddhe he buddhe as in. Of nyana, nyana sya, acha buddhe he, samuchaya sya. For there to be a samuchaya combination of karma, uh, uh, of of uh, nyana with karma, there has to be karma first. Only nyana is there. Karma is not there at all. Why? Because he is akarta. Uh, how can akarta have karma? Kartrutva should be there. We have seen earlier. Kartrutva, kartrutva are opposing. Ekatva, ekatva are opposing. This person is, thinks of ekatva here, ekameva, akarta, akarta ham iti manyate. He thinks himself as akarta. So onlooker sees onlooker sees karma is happening. He is doing. He thinks it is doing. He is doing. But what is the nyanit thinking? Karma may be happening. Guna gune shuvartante. He will say further. Guna gune shuvartante. He has no play there. He is completely disconnected. Prarabdha is continuing. Therefore. Karma is not there at all. Ye na buddhe samuchya sya. There is no possibility of combination at all. There would be had there been karma. There is no karma at all. Sorry, I have taken five minutes more. I'll stop here. Om shanti shanti shanti. Any questions? No questions. Okay.